This is actually day 20, believe it or not, man. Yeah? <laughs> day 20. Trips we really fly by. <laughs> the 2 0 mark, that's insane. We spent a, a night out in Belgium, and uh, I was telling Marco yesterday it was a great stop because you got to feel the Belgium experience, you know what I mean? Um, the dinner and stuff, met some uh, local people, the uh, staff at the restaurant was super chill, we were talking to them for a while. And uh, we're off to the train station right now, and then we uh, step foot in Amsterdam in uh, a couple of hours. Where are we at? We're in Amsterdam. We just got out of the train station and we realized Marco has the official mascot Dutch uniform on. Stop for a uh, bunch of weed bones. Just some cod. It's a nice little rose tree. There's some coffee in the back, it seems like. Oh, very nice, thank you. It's quite nice. That was beautiful, dude. Yeah, that beautiful cup of coffee. Cheers to uh, green coffee. <laughs> I was doing coffee. Finally <laughs> checked in myself. I just locked myself into the room. First impression, they put on all these lights to piss you off. <laughs> and I got karmatized instantly. Pretty dope spot, you got a little balcony out of here. Overlooking some trees and my home bro. Uh, but that is, isn't that funny though? I actually got locked out because they put on all those lights, karma, yeah. And uh, here's a little treat for you guys. We uh, got a little, <laughs> we actually made this, but they were nice enough to give us a couple apples and some chocolate water. But uh, let me check these bad boys out. You got cherry coke and cherry vanilla, or sorry, coke vanilla, um, zero sugar too, so. Some of the most fire coke cola you can get. Cause you're just telling me that uh, you got tickets to Heineken experience? <laughs> we got tickets to Heineken and tickets to the, to the, uh, you know, the other one, the big, uh, big boy. Big boy museum, big boy that's museum. really hard to uh, pronounce. Rijksmuseum. <laughs> Museum Exquisite. We have Ram Ram, Van Gogh. What, 13 minutes to get to the Heineken uh -oh. Tour Museum? <laughs> it gives us about four minutes to spare, actually. <laughs> Quick. Number one fact. Number one fact. Number one fact. 
Outside the Heineken experience. Oh. Cheers. Um, That's the building right there. You can see on the top of it. Right across the street. <laughs> it was fun. I mean, we've been to a couple now, like Coca Cola. Um, that was kind of one of my top ones, to be honest. Coke had a good one, but uh, we bought a couple of branded beers. Like you put your uh, your name on the label. So what we thought it would be good to do is just uh, give the parents a shout out. So we did one for Ma and one for uh, for Dad. And uh, we did a uh, love potion number nine for my mom. Yeah, it's her favorite it's song to sing. One of her karaoke. favorite songs, yeah. And then uh, Curtis did uh, De Dan uh, the Bull, yeah. it's just for you know, Pop's nickname. We make fun of him. joke, we used to call her dad. Yeah, so uh, well, sure enough, what does Curtis do today? Come oh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> you can probably see it still. You see the foam on the uh, the beer there? We uh, not we, but I, I smashed it. The bottle down in the gift store because uh the cardboard box was like kind of so flimsy good, but uh we're actually gonna drink him, so. yeah we're, we're gonna drink it right now out of uh out of i guess memory. you can call it a tribute or whatever but uh yeah it's quite like a throw uh shout out but like I mean, it's mainly because i assume you don't want to bring these home that and yeah you don't want to carry around how much uh what are these like whatever beer is 350 or something ml um that and also too they're actually really reasonably priced they're like the price of almost a beer plus maybe a buck or two. So, uh, cheers. Yeah, cheers to uh, Amsterdam day one. One of two. <laughs> 